We've all heard of Game 4 MK Leo, uh, but there's nothing quite, but there's also nothing quite like a loser's bracket Lily Bun, uh, where when she has lost those uh, sets uh, against uh, players, she makes a, a hell of a loser's run and makes it all the way to grand, Grands and wins the tournament. Right. Um, so that is something to, to keep in mind yeah, here, but ready. you mentioned it yourself. UPT Three, is one of those players two, who has been able to beat out one. Lily Bun. Lily Bun herself has mentioned that he is one of the only people who's beaten her in bracket. Uh, but we're going to see if he's able to continue that streak. Going into the Lincoln Loud, I know he mentions that uh, SpongeBob Shredder, not a good matchup for Shredder. Uh, so I think he feels more comfortable on Link Lincoln, probably a little bit more even. Both of these characters fundamentally are very, very similar. Um, but SpongeBob kind of seen as just the better character, better recovery, better projectile, uh, just a little bit better combo game as well. It's interesting, right? We've seen the same matchup kind of before. I think like off back to like a hidden temple with uh, Pasta versus uh, Mirror Man, for example. The same kind of thing you use. At the same time, the Lily Bun's a completely different SpongeBob. Getting that first stock off UPG. You can do a different link and keep that in mind. I know his link is pretty newer, but that's he's been putting a decent amount of work in these tournaments. Putting a, a decent amount indeed. Definitely not the stinking loud we've come to know uh, from from history from uh, days past, but is able to put in a lot of work. Lilybun, great use of the bubble into the heavy up smash. It looks like we're getting the scary slow mo right now. Uh, it looks like ultimate, but we're still seeing it get played out, no doubt. Yeah, it seems like it's just on our end if that's the case. Yeah, I'm gonna right. try restarting my game after this just to be sure. For sure. Look at some slow motion flashes. This game looks so different in slow mo. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so weird. It's so weird seeing it in slow motion. Maybe this this is kind of actually how I feel uh, whenever I get comboed by either of these characters. It just feels like I'm watching it in slow motion. There's like nothing I can do. You know what I mean? Yeah, definitely. I feel you. Um, but, you know, UPG was able to finally like get that stock off of the throw. 91% um, not undoable. You know, he does have a really great... One thing I don't think UPG gets a lot of credit for, he does have a great ledge trapping game. Um, his yeah. ledge trapping is pretty strong. Granted, you know, he is he does have one of the best nares in the whole game on Shredder. Um, but even before that, with, like, Leonardo and other characters like Blinken, he mm -hmm. is very proficient at it. Yeah, I mean, he was infamous for, you know, the Leonardo ledge trapping back in, like, patch one days. Or not patch one, but, like, you know, the first couple right. patch days. I don't want to remember those days. <laughs> uh, against Leo, I couldn't. I, I literally couldn't get out of the corner. Yeah, yeah, good times, good times. Of course, UPG trying to make some good signs right now. Hit him with a scooter, getting that stock off. Even game right now. Dead even game. We're seeing that kind of come in stride. Where UPG has done, has done well. In fact, to uh, to keep his composure against Lily Bun, uh, but Lily yeah. Bun answer him back right oh now. Oh my god. Yeah. That was she such got, crazy gobble right there, jeez. She got the heavy dare into the the nair. You know, she said, "Nope, I'm, I found another way to kill you. I don't even need dare dare." Wait, I was watching. You did get the forge strong. Wow, using that stinking move. Oh, oh that's that's you strong call that stinking move? That's a, that's a very stinking move. But that strong dare is not a stinking move at all. That have she helped edge guard Lily Bun quite that much. And we got last stop situation. Last stock situation and anything can happen, you know, Lincoln, even though he does have kind of the reputation to be stinky, he can make some really crazy stuff happen with his uh, his ledge strapping and his combo game because his combo game oh. is pretty good and we're oh. seeing that right now. Oh, this is so scary. Okay, UPG is yeah. disadvantage. Great use of the dreidel. Back in neutral, we're seeing him use that dreidel a little bit more to kind of space out, interrupt uh, Lily's uh, advantage state. Right. Uh, but Lily Bun is adapting really well. One thing is she just grabs so quick, and no, one more window was gonna happen. Classic. Lily Bun won that force window. So, okay, so, did you say forced? All right, we're 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 getting back. We're we're booting it back up. Nickelodeon All Star Brawl. Let's 
lobby. Welcome back. You never answered my question. You said Lily won the forced game. <laughs> I don't know, dude. What's the force? Uh, you know, the force from Star Wars. Oh, okay, gotcha. I mean, she kind of does have the force, you know? To a degree, both of those players have the force. They they, they force people to lose the game. <laughs> yeah, that's you're to look at it. Yeah. I mean, you're, you're talking about that kind of force, right? Uh, yeah. For sure. Okay. Uh, the UPG, though, I mean, we're, we're seeing it right now. Uh, he's Good. going back to that uh, that shredder uh, Kree stab. We can't see. Um, How'd you know he was going shredder then? I was watching your stream. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, I have the stream open so I can look at chat and and uh, to see like kind of what's going on and in there. That's why I'm talking about it a little bit, like with Urkin. I saw somebody talk about how Urkin's not a good stage for Nigel, which is, I, I don't agree with that. But what I do agree with is the Shredder pick because we're seeing it come out in true, uh, true colors for UPG. Is able to get that first stock in a dominating fashion. Oh, wow. Might even get the second stock in a dominating fashion. Ooh, just a Definitely. little late on the on the neutral heavy. It's interesting. Like, I know the Shredder's gonna say this is a pretty bad matchup, but I honestly think it can be kind of back and forth, really. I mean, of course, SpongeBob combos the hell out of this character, but two, it's gonna be very hard for SpongeBob to get in on such a move like Nair, for example. It can be very hard for SpongeBob to get in, and that's one of his biggest issues. I mean, if you talk to Lily and Mirror Man, they'll say that one of SpongeBob's biggest flaws is he doesn't have a safe uh, on shield option or like a, a really like disjointed approach option uh, mm -hmm. outside of outside of Nair. Even then, Nair can put you in a bad situation if it's shielded. Um, so you have to have an understanding of how your neutral works and your approach options uh, work. Um, in, in this matchup, especially. Right, you kind of need to have, like, Bubble out, you know, get a good offense. Like, even then, though, you have a move that can go right through Bubble, like Shredder has, and like, you can get in. Yeah, the Lily Bunch right Bubble. Oh, yeah, most definitely. Lily Bunch find the way in for sure. He's trying to get a lot of damage on UPG. But the, UPG uh, following with that up here. Most definitely. Oh. Oh, yeah, I got kicked out of the stream as well. Um, but looks like we're still in a dead even stock game as we're seeing these jabs come out. UPG, mm. what is... You, you gotta fix that DI, homie. Yeah, that was a very smart bounce to get out, though. Very smart. Uh, incredibly smart uh, to get out of that. Oh, we see UPG oh, wow. try to go for the edge guard. Uh, gets hit by the bubble. Mm -hmm. The reversal with the bite chomped on him. We, we saw it happen happen twice. He went for uh, the edge guard, got hit by Bubble. Went for the edge guard again, got bit to death. Right, most definitely. So call, uh, SpongeBob, he's more like a cat because if a cat bites you, that that'll kill you. Actually, I'm not kidding either. Like look that Very up. Fun a cat, yeah, a cat bite can actually kill you. Uh, one thing, uh, one other thing is we, do is we might actually see UPG take this, but I'm surprised uh, that was an air up front that would have done a lot more damage. Definitely, a lot more damage uh, would have uh, put Lily Bun in, I, I'd say, a worse situation. Right. Um, but um, UPG, I just don't know if he was confident going for it or if it was just uh, <gasps> would not able oh. to get the awareness. Oh my God! Falls out of the light up air. It's so crucial. Oh, we're seeing it now. Oh man, Lily Bone was just facing the wrong direction. Right. These blocks and these new tributes are so clutch though. She's always getting the punches on them. Make it very difficult for UPG to get a free option to get in, but punches the whiff right there yeah! and we <laughs> desynced again. This is great. <laughs> oh man, okay, who won that game? I'm still waiting for them to report it. Lily Bun did. Lily okay. Bun to, uh, okay, so. Oh man, you know, maybe that's the problem. Maybe like when the when the game goes off, it's just like Lilybun gets all of her power back. She's like, "All right, I'm gonna win," and then just wins. So that like that a... that. Oh, go ahead. I was like, "Yeah, it just kind of blacks out." I suppose. It's like, <laughs> yeah, maybe when we're spectating the game, UPG's like, you know, Terminator mode, and then when he, you know, we're not spectating, he kind of like shuts right. down. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's just, just a theory. Three, right. Two, it's just in general though, Lily Bun's just 
clutch factor, just none to stop that. Both of those games went down to the wire for sure, but she clutched both of those out. We'll see if the same goes true for game three. And she's done a really good job holding composure. I mean, definitely, you know, not a top player for nothing. All the top players are able to hold their composure very well. Mm -hmm. Especially, you have to be able to against a character like Shredder. Because Shredder is just really just so um, debilitating to fight. Oh my <laughs> god. She was going so deep down there. Sacked up so much damage to UPD. Starting to kill up the bike. Thank you for UPD. Let's see another day. She wanted the Twitter clip. She wanted it bad. <laughs> That's definitely. Oh, yeah. Um, eats the up B. And you've already split it up. So first off, really bun. And ooh, he's probably got a super early KO right there. Shredder, one of the people who can do that. That up air so deceptively strong. It can kill you right off the top. Mm. And Shredder's just one of those characters that can reach so far. But SpongeBob doesn't need to Dude. reach so far. He can do the karate. Get that kill early. It's so insane just how good the lead button is just finding ways in. That was so crazy. You see that I like forward, um, the dash draw? That was just insane right there. He just caught you in the moment that he just wasn't looking for. It. And that goes back to just how I would say good she is at mixing, uh, mixing up her approaches. She does a really good job of not relying on the same neutral tools over and over again. We see her rely on bubble quite a bit. But she's, you know, made it very clear that Bubble is kind of your main in with SpongeBob, which makes yeah. sense. But every time she approaches, she doesn't do the same thing over and over and over again. Yeah. Like you right there, she got him by running and blocking the UPG's face. It got so much out of that. Almost a KO, though, not quite. Oh, man. We saw the patience from her there, too. Uh, she just waited to see what UPG uh, was going to do. We had two options. You go towards the Sage or go towards the ledge. You have to go, go towards stage, which is actually a really smart play because that, that was the, the safer bet. Because had he gone towards ledge, I'm almost certain he would have died. Oh, oh God, the air dash with the air up strong. Okay, Lily. And we're seeing Lily right now, 93%. Uh, this could still... She could still one of, the, one of those characters oh. that's able to get a lot off, a lot off one hit, but... Shredder kind of the same deal, 107% only at 20. Really, really tried to go for that early KO. If you attempt, man, you gotta try for whatever you can. Definitely. Oh, I bear misses light up here, though. Just facing the wrong way, unfortunate. Oh no, it's so much damage on the Shredder right now. So this is the situation that he thrives on in this matchup for sure, which makes it so annoying for a lot of the Shredder players to deal with. Hey, yeah. Oh man, Lilybun was waiting for that. She had the read and everything, but just got hit out of it. But she's gonna get it that time though. 121%. Let's see, is UPG able to clutch this out? Able to get this stock and move on into a game four situation? Or will he fall here? Let us find out. Oh, ooh, missed the air down strong. I was about to say that was it, but okay, okay. Darren's up air, still very doable. All these games went to the last stock, by the way. That's so crazy. Yeah, UPG not making it easy for Lilybun. Uh, really fighting tooth and nail, does not want to fall on the losers right now. Dude, every time he went for an up throw into that air up strong, Millie's possession maxed out. That's so crazy. We've seen him get it all, like, we've got, seen him get it one time. Um, yeah. And that's it. And then Lily just has not let him get it since. Uh, but we are seeing these Nairs come out. Lily mm -hmm. Bun does not have a resource here. Goes to the ledge. Smart decision, but she's caught off stage once again. Was ready for the roll in, but not quite. Go over the head, down here, and misses it. And he's going oh, to no. the top of the No! no. UPG, such a madman, dude. Oh, he went for it all, and he paid the price there. Goes for the dare and has to recover, misses ledge, and falls to his death right into the karate chop. That was an impressive set from UPG, able to take it to last stock every single set, but just was so close so many times, but not able to follow it up.